all old buildings have noises, uh, but there are some you can't really explain, like footsteps on when you're the only one in the building. Enid's Gaslight Theater is charming, but it's also known to send shivers up some spines. There's also a rumor that we have a resident ghost, uh, which I don't think you can be a theater without having a ghost. The signs are simple. Windows upstairs rattling a little bit when there really isn't any wind. I know it does happen sometime in Oklahoma, but there are times there are no wind, but you still hear some sounds like that. The history and the proof of days gone by was uncovered during construction back in the 1990s. When we started tearing things out, raising the money and getting going, we discovered that the original floor that was the vaudeville floor back in the teens and 20s was still there. That was just pretty awesome. It's proof of the theater's age, but it's something else that has some folks doing double takes. One of our technicians was up on the light grid moving lights around and saw the shape of someone off on the other end of the catwalk and said, you know, come on over here, I'll back. I could use another pair of hands to move this stuff. And um, the figure didn't move and when he looked up again, the figure wasn't there anymore. Just, you could kind of see the shadowy silhouette of a person, uh, but didn't go down the ladder and never really left. If you don't see a ghost, you can still scare up a good story at the Gaslight. We were doing a show called 12 Angry Jurors, and I was assistant directing, and I was 19, and Monty was juror number... Eight. Juror number eight. <laughs> and and uh, that's how we first met, and we started dating a couple years later and got married. And you can always catch a good show. The folks who've played a part are still pretty passionate about their time here. We recently had our, our 20th anniversary celebration for Shakespeare in the Park. 20 years of free Shakespeare in little Enid, Oklahoma. And we had a reunion for actors uh, who had been on 20 years of Shakespeare on stage. And it was over, not all of them made it back, but the grand total was over 350 actors who had been in the park playing various parts in Shakespeare and to have them come back from like a seven to 10 state area and they walked through the door and it was like you were back doing, you know, as you like it from 15 years ago. The old theater is full of spirits, all right. It's passion, it's art, it's humanity, it's laughter, it's tears. It's just, it's, it's what it is to be a human being. Which one you get just may depend on how close you are to Halloween. There are times that I don't like being in certain parts of the building at night by myself. 